Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. Wow, it's Christmas Eve 2022. It's been an amazing year. It's been a tough year. A lot has gone on. A lot of emotion, a lot of hard work, a lot of downs, a lot of ups. Lots and lots has happened this year. It's Christmas time. It's a magical time. The most wonderful time of the year. Today's been amazing and it's been very full on, very, very busy Christmas Eve. For me, this morning, very, very early this morning, before seven this morning, actually, the turkey was in the oven. I was helping my mum prepare the turkey for the Christmas dinner tomorrow and all of what goes with that. It was really, really great to spend time just me and my mum the first thing this morning before seven. We opened the box fizz and we had a really, really lovely time and getting ready in the, this morning and preparations for that and... A little bit later on, then in the morning, we all had breakfast together. And then after a very, very formal event in my family, we go to the crematorium here in my local town, which is where my uh, my very dear nan, um, who is my absolute world, um, her grave with my grandfather is there. So we lay a wreath, and this year I had a wreath lay, uh, made at our florist who done my nan's funeral flowers. And that was absolutely beautiful. Um, so we laid that with my, uh, my two elder brothers and my mum. And that was really very nice. Uh, a very lovely occasion, very, very nice, um, and very, very moving, very, very much so. Following from that, we went for a bit of a drive, and then we visited my aunt and uncle, my my very dear aunt, who I absolutely love and adore. And it was really, really great to catch up with them as well, my mum being there, and my other two brothers. I have three brothers, but sadly, my twin brother was working today. So it was really, really great to catch up and have those really lovely memories and laughter and reminiscing over great times, which was wonderful as well. And about my nan and and different things about my brothers as they were younger and me and one thing or another, which is great. And then after a few more Christmas preparations, then of course over to my brother's house, who was hosting Christmas Eve, which was really, very really lovely. So that was my brother and my sister-in-law, my niece and my nephew, and then my other niece and my uh, my twin brother made it. So it was really, really lovely. We opened the Prosecco and we had a really, really lovely time and uh, it was very, very nice. Christmas Eve is of course all about family and then I come home and now it's my mum and, and dad and and my brothers and, uh, and, and yeah, it's... um. It's it's just very, very emotional. Very it's the second Christmas about now, and so everything's full of emotion, raw emotion. There's laughter, there is tears, I'll be quite honest, there is tears at times. Um, but it's a very, very magical uh time of year. And you know what? It's just wonderful. It really, really is. So that was my Christmas Eve, and it's been an um, it's been a magical one. It's been really, really lovely indeed. Christmas, of course, is a very powerful time, uh, full of all different emotions, um, but it's a magical one, and it's one which I really, really do hope that you can you can grab and embrace with both hands, and you can share it with your loved ones, and I hope this evening you have an amazing, amazing later and latter part of Christmas Eve, um, with kind of, I'll be having nibbles and drinks and things with family, and it will be really, really lovely, and mum and dad, and, and yeah, I get into the Christmas pyjamas, out of all this festive attire which I've got on, blue velvet jacket, as you can see, which I absolutely love silk tie to match absolutely love that too hope <laughs> the hair slick back all all good so it's been a really really great time to connect with family to connect with loved ones and I've, I've i've met this week with the reverend who took my nan's service he was a very dear friend of mine so it was really really great to do that a good friend of mine from school i've caught up with this christmas season too other friends of mine which has been really really great um it's just been great the the whole of december has been absolutely amazing so now we're at the front door of course at christmas we're banging on it hard and fast and of course tomorrow the great the stage of christmas day um and of course um of faith and of course of just coming together and and if if you're not of that then just having that relaxing time with family and friends and loved ones but for me it's a mixture of everything so it's really really great for that as well Lord above has given me a lot of comfort this year as always. It means a whole lot to me and my nan is up above um, with my grandfather and my aunt and my auntie Kim and my uncle Malcolm and and yes that means so much to me. So Christmas has a very a very strong aspect of faith for me as well and the Lord above which means so much. But of course it's a great time to come to family and it's just amazing to to really have those magical times of everybody around the Christmas table or the Christmas tree or the fire and and just exchange gifts, exchange just that really, really magical, magical time. And I really do wish that all my subscribers and everybody who watches this clip enjoys a very, very amazing Christmas for 2022. Bearing in mind this Christmas, of course, we are in the middle of 
a world where everything is getting more and more expensive. And of course, having those lavish times becomes quite quite a quite an expensive venture. But Christmas doesn't have to be expensive. And if you're sat there and you're thinking, well, actually, I couldn't do as much this year. Do you know what? Put those thoughts out of your head, because Christmas is all about showing that you care, that you love, not how much you can spend or how much is going to be, I don't know, on bills or statements in the new year or anything like that. That's not what Christmas is. If you're blessed enough to be able to cherish and to be able to absolutely shower people with gifts, then amazing. But if you're not, you know what? Don't put those negative thoughts there because you are doing well. Just a gesture, just a gesture of goodwill, a smile. And you know what? Just being together, having a lovely meal around a table, just being together. You don't have to have spent lots of money at all. Christmas is perfect and is wonderful because you're healthy and well. And that's what I always say around our Christmas table as well. I am very fortunate and I thank the Lord every day for that. I really, truly do. I've been born into a family where my parents mean absolutely everything and my, my dear nan. And um, I have an amazing, amazing family. But family is everything at Christmas. It truly, truly is. It's been a tough year, tough, tough year, and I say that several times because it has been. There's so much going on. We've come through the COVID pandemic. We've, we've then hit up against the cost of living crisis, and things are just getting more and more expensive in this world. And times are tough for everybody. And then, of course, with that element of well-being and uh, emotional health and mental health, and one thing and another. We really do need to support and look after one another. I've been saying all season, let's open our hearts a little bit extra. Let's open our hands. And do you know what? Let's open our heart more importantly. Why did I say hands there, you may think? Well, let's get going and doing something special when you're going to need them to be able to do something special. Christmas, of course, is so, so amazing and wonderful. I'm blessed to have my nieces and nephews in my family, and I absolutely adore that. Seeing the young little ones with their gifts and looking forward to Santa and things, it is a very, very magical time. My niece actually recently said to me at 11 years old that there's no such thing as Santa. Ah, I said, yes, there may not be just one Santa, but there certainly is Christmas magic. And I say that to any adult or any child, that there certainly is Christmas magic. And when Christmas comes around, it brings its cheer and almost like sends this tingle up your spine. And once you've had Christmas and New Year and you look at everything, it almost feels empty. So there certainly is Christmas magic. This year has been really, really tough for a lot of people. And I wish all of my subscribers a very, very happy, merry, splendid Christmas. I really do hope that they have an amazing one. Every single subscriber, thank you so much for all your support this year. It truly means the world to me. To every single minute which has been watched on my channel, to every single subscriber, to every single second where you sat there and listened to me, thank you from the bottom of my heart and to yours. Thank you very much. God bless you. Take great, great care. And I wish you from the bottom of my heart to yours a very, very merry, very, very happy Christmas and much love to you and your family. I really hope you have an incredible time. Happy Christmas to you 2022, and I'll be seeing you in the new year. God bless and take great care. Merry Christmas.